Hey everybody, how you doing? Hopefully doing good. If not, hopefully I can cheer up, please distract you. Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed the unboxing of this controller. Um, I did what I could with the cameras. Um, if I do, um, well, this is a pretty good view. Uh, let me open it up a little more for you guys. Um, let me use my lap here. Uh, don't have a place for my mouse right now. I mean, there's one right here. I don't know if my arrow's on it in, this, in the video. So let me open this baby up so you can see a little better. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, she's gorgeous. Um, so I'm really happy with it. And um, it's a four-channel uh, controller. It's the, the Pioneer DDJ FLX6. In other words, the Flex 6. Okay, basically. And uh, it's it's real cool. I, I really enjoyed it. I didn't like it first how the platters kind of picked up some of the fingerprints but whatever is picking up coats it evenly and then it looks like a normal shine like a normal nice even shine after a while playing with them I don't know why that is maybe there was a coating from the from the factory that didn't come off all the way and I rubbed it all off somehow believe it or not I didn't even use a napkin I just used my hands to stay have a grip to them and I went like this to them just to see if I could even out even a little more. Kind of humoring myself now. Or uh, was then. Anyway, this is real cool. It turns on and everything. I hope I don't have any problems. Uh, I want to turn it on now. Because I'm recording and all this stuff is running. So, let's see how it does. I hope I have no problems. Um, hope you guys enjoy the light show. Yeah, look at that. That's amazing. Um... So that was it. That's how it turns on. After a while, it'll do a little song and dance without the music, of course. It's just a light show um, that it does. And it looks real nice. These spin. Look like they're spinning. They're not spinning. It's just a light show in the middle, as you just saw. And, uh, yeah, it's real cool. It's real cool. I really enjoy it. Anyhow, um, wow, what kind of a rating would I give this? Well, I don't like the gimmicks. I don't like the gimmicks. I don't like the... Um, merge effects i use this effects section here i'm fine with the traditional stuff here and um also i don't like the um i mean i could try it and see if i like it a little more but i haven't tried it uh the jog cutter i've heard it i've seen it and i'm not interested in it i never was i just wanted something with four channels and that was it and mainly the effects here you know and the traditional effects on top as well I just want to work my way up one day to a CDJ, uh, a pair of CDJs in a nice mixer, you know, uh, or something like it. Like the, um, what I might get in the future would be the um, DDJ-1000, okay? Not the SRT, no SRT for me, thank you. That thing is like the, um, well, I, I like the one over the other because uh, that one's made for record box. Okay, and the other one is not made for that machine. It's not made for the uh, SRT-1000. It's like saying they're trying to make a Serato software for the DDJ-1000, but they weren't able to. That's all I can say. And put everything back the way it was. Uh, use my lap again uh, for this. Let me back up a little bit. There you go. And bring that in. Right around there should be good okay so yeah yeah it's just real cool and um i'm gonna unplug it because um i don't like how it affects my stuff you know i don't like how it dominates computers most of them do um this one is not doing it now i've seen it fail uh, i want to touch on that and i think that's why i've been rambling because i needed time to think about this um i need a moment to remember this um it was it was crashing on me. I mean, the whole unit would just shut off. Sometimes it would just freeze uh, as well. And there's a reason for that. And I think it's I think it's my fault. Um, a tip would be that if you have you have these cables coming out of here and it's going to your stereo, then don't have the computer putting out the sound as well. Don't do that. Um, you're having it work too hard. I think I'm guessing. I mean, it's only bus power. It doesn't have its own other power only bus power so i don't think it was the power at all so i didn't give it enough credit and now i am i i think it's really nice to have it's more professional than people would explain i mean a lot of people like their metal units to be you know they like a nice nice solid metal unit 
this one's fine with me. I'm happy with it. Um, I thought it had a metal top. There's, there's no metal top. It's all plastic. Um, pretty plasticky. This is not really a review of this um, thing. I'm just, you know, telling you how I feel about it at the moment. And uh, uh, I'll be getting back to gaming pretty soon, hopefully. Um, I, I'll be honest. I've been busy on this thing. And um, it's very important that I work it out. Because if I don't work it out, um, uh, I'll probably miss my window to send it back if I have to send it back. And um, I don't, I, I don't want to send it back. I don't think I have to. So I'm just taking the, the time that I need, guys. Um, you know, um, I want to spend more time with you guys. And I'm going to try and do that, squeeze you guys in. And I love doing my videos still. I still love, love doing my videos. Um, I want to do some DJing for you guys soon, hopefully. Uh, I'm going to give myself a few months first. Um, get to know my music more. And get to know this thing more. And uh, I'll get to you guys on that too. Okay, hopefully. Hopefully. I want to do that. We definitely want to do that. Uh, my son. Um, I'm looking for my other son too. I want to join his um, SoundCloud. So my son is Julian Eka. E-C-H-A. And Adam Eka. E-C-H-A. Okay. They're on SoundCloud. And I want to put something together for them. I'm going to ask them permission, of course, before I... Well, if I put something together, it might be for myself. I don't know if I'm going to release it. If I do release it, that would be cool because my sons do original stuff, you know. Anyhow, that's it. Anyway, um, I want to include them. They're a big part of my life. I pushed them towards it. Um, they pushed themselves very well. They, I told them to top themselves. They're topping themselves. They're not trying to top anybody else. And they know how to go jogging speed. Speaking of jogging speed, I like that they call these the jog wheels. I want to say something about that. I think they're called jog wheels because speed, when it comes to mixing and scratching, speed comes on its own. So it's a good thing they call them jog wheels. When you go jogging, when you go jogging, you don't worry about speed. You just worry about getting going. You know, you take your time. And believe it or not, even believe it or not, you're still taking your time, no matter how fast you wind up. Isn't that fascinating? How fast we get, even though we're just taking our time. That's why I tell people, super slow is super fast. What's important is that you execute, pinpoint. That's it. Slow is super fast. That's all. And um, later you can worry about speed. Every once in a while. Okay? To test yourself. You know? Anyway, thanks a lot for watching. Please like and subscribe. If you feel like if you're feeling me, uh, take care of yourself. Take care of each other. Bye-bye. I'll be here to distract too. Okay? Not just to cheer people up. Some people, they don't want, they don't care about being cheered up. They just want a distraction. I'm here for that. Bye-bye.